Hello and welcome to a new video. I'm Vanguard and today we'll be going through my best budget gaming PC for $500. We'll be going through all the parts. Depending on what time you watch this video, the price may vary. This should be able to handle high-end games at 1080p, ultra settings 60 FPS. For about $500, you should be able to make a beast of a PC. But without further ado, let's get right into it. First up is the heart of the computer, the CPU. This will be the Intel Core i3-6100 processor. Though it's a dual core, it can actually handle games very nicely due to hyper-threading acting like a quad-core CPU. This should be fine in any game and won't bottleneck the graphics card. Next is the GPU. I went with the EVGA GeForce GTX 1060 3GB Gaming. This is actually quite a beast of a card and can easily handle any game at 1080p. Benchmarks of the card is pretty awesome, achieving nice FPS at even 1440p, but not quite 60fps. For the RAM, we went the potential of two 4GB RAM sticks. 8GB of RAM for gaming is perfectly fine being just more than you need. This is the standard of big games nowadays. The motherboard I went with the Gigabyte LGA1151 Intel H110 Micro ATX. This is a pretty decent deal for the price, being everything you need. Next is Deep Cool Gamma XX400 CPU cooler. This is a widely popular choice for coolers that gets the job done. For the power supply, we have an EVGA 500 Watt 80 Plus White. The power it provides will be more than enough as we have a very efficient build including the PCU itself. Hard drives are obviously another important part of the build. I'll be going with the Western Digital 1TB drive. Since we're on a tight budget, I will be not including an SSD because this should ideally be suffice. However, if you want an SSD on the list, you can go with the Kingston Digital 120GB drive and trade the GTX 1060 for RX 470. Either way, this should be a beast of a build. Finally is the DIY Zonda B Black Mid Tower Gaming Computer. Not too fancy of a case but gets the job done. It looks quite nice as well and you can pick the colours that it comes with. Depending on what you want, you could go with a cheaper option or a more premium option to please the eye. So that about wraps up this video. If you enjoyed, please leave a like, comment and subscribe. Let me know what your thoughts are down below. Thank you for watching and until next time, I'll see you later.